Hello everybody, Elegant Melon here. Welcome back to my channel. And today I have a package that I've only been waiting for since, you know, July. <laughs> no big deal. So, here we go. So excited. Oh, like... Before we get into actually opening the package, let me, let me find something out real quick. Don't mind me. I'm just looking for my exacto knife. There it is. Because it looks like there's, like I can't really show you, but it looks like there's two different packages. Packing information's under here, and I'm very curious right now. So, now it's just one folded over piece of tape. So One folded over piece of paper. Awesome. So, I'll just go ahead and open this like this. So, for anybody who's wondering, way back in April, May, somewhere around there, I joined a group order for the M-Wave signed Gravity album for the for season one. Okay, the person I ordered through, I did the group order through. They ended up not getting the albums until like early July. Okay. And so I was waiting. I was <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you two? Anyway, so I joined this group order. They got the albums early July. I was like, okay, should be getting my albums, my signed album soon. I, you know, confirmed what I was getting, all of that jazz. You know, it was a fun time, you know. And then, you know, they post, I'm waiting, and I go to their uh, page, and they had posted that a bunch of the albums had gotten sent back to them and so they were just waiting they were holding them for two weeks and then they were going to be sending them back out so I'm like okay um I was like okay that works you know I wasn't I had I hadn't gotten my album, so I looked at their page. That's what I was like, okay, you know. Well, so I'm just sitting here chilling. It gets, it was like mid-November when I started being like, okay, what the hell is up? Because I was just like, you know, there was so much in the news like, hey, you know, there's issues with the mail and all of this stuff. So I was just like, I am going to be patient. Well, then... <laughs> I messaged them 
Um, I want to say it was, uh, I, I messaged them. I want to say, uh, early December. I'm like, hey, you know, I never got my album. Can, is there anything you can look up to, is there anything you can give me to, like, give the post office to try and find my album and they're like I will look into it for you I'm like okay whatever and then and then <laughs> something pops up on my informed delivery app with a tracking number coming from the city and state that they live in. And it said the shipping label was printed December 22nd. That. So I'm just wondering, like I'm not gonna name and shame this person because I mean, shit freaking happens like i've i mean i figure a seasoned group order manager might you know should probably have their shit together a little bit better than this but like as somebody who has sold stuff and traded and everything before Sometimes shit happens and you just like forget or you get busy. But not fucking five months busy. So I'm just kind of wondering like what the end goal was here. I'm not naming and shaming though, but it's just what was the end goal here. I'm a little annoyed. Anyways, here is my Ruben signed album. I love it, even though, like, <laughs> I kind of just pissed myself off going into that, so uh, I, I can't even properly love and appreciate that I have this in my hands now but it's like I'm just kind of like what the fuck man oh at least they didn't jip me on my inclusions I got I mean, I feel like there's a lot of people who would be like, okay, uh, you should name and shame this person, but I'm really not going to because, like, I don't know, but I just, I, I don't get it, and Like, how? And the fact, and it's not even the fact, like, that, you know, it was missing for five months. It's the fact that, like, this says December 22nd. And I messaged them about it. Let me, let me, let me pull this up real quick. Yeah, I messaged them about it December 3rd. And it's like... Excuse me, I 
like I'm just I'm just so confused right now and I'm confused. So confused. <laughs> like I'm I mean, the interesting thing is my hair was still the same color back then. <laughs> Even though I've gone through like three, at least three different hair colors between <laughs> then and now. <laughs> but it's just... Anyway, I'm so happy now. Like, I finally have it. <laughs> I, I, I've... I've been low-key stressed about it for, like, since July, and now I have my signed album. <laughs> but yeah, so, I'm happy. This was an unnecessarily stressful ordeal, and, um was in another group order so and that one's going a lot better uh, <laughs> I like not like another album group order I joined a group order for the um Espa merch um from not the SM Town Global one but like the actual SM website and I ordered some four by sixes because those were really cute. I didn't like any of the other merch but the four by sixes were cute. They had that like digital flowery basically the original teasers like the introduction picture um concept for um the 4x6s and I really liked that concept and also I don't have a bias yet because like I'm kind of holding off on picking getting a bias in ESPA or at least claiming somebody as my bias until like I find out <laughs> if the rumors were true and they're adding three more members because if they add three more members like if I decide that like like, right now, if I had to say somebody in Espo was my bias, it'd probably be Winter. But, like, if I... Like, I don't want to say, yes, Winter is my bias, and then some... They add more members, like, is rumored, and then... I decided to buy us one of them, and then now I have all this winter stuff that I collected that, like, I don't want to get myself into the situation I got myself in with where I end up collecting three members. <laughs> not that, not that I really regret that decision. Okay, I do kind of regret that decision. No offense, Wubin. I love you. <laughs> um, but like, I have a gravity poster right above my filming desk. <laughs> I also have that one there uh, that is a little bit torn up by my cats. And then I have another one over there. <laughs> They're all the season one posters because my season two posters got wrecked by that dumb orange thing right there. Well, that dumb orange thing. And there's another dumb orange thing around here somewhere that also helped. That one's a white and orange thing, though. 
it is named Bean. <laughs> but yeah, so I have my signed Cravity album. I am happy now. <laughs> this whole ordeal can be put to rest. And, um, yeah. I think the other dumb orange thing might actually be hiding in my, uh, bed because uh, there was a small hole in the box frame of my bed. And now there's a big hole that the cats can get into. And yes, the dumb white and orange thing is in my bed. But yeah, so like, I don't know how I got ranting about Espa. Oh yeah, joined another group order. Um, as far as I know, like, the person has gotten their stuff. They just haven't, like, figured out uh, domestic shipping or anything like that yet. So, I don't know. Um, I haven't gotten any emails about it. I don't think. At least I'm pretty sure I didn't. Um, oh, we're in the wrong email. I have not gotten anything about the Esper group order, so, I, yeah. Oh, hey, there's the dumb or other dumb orange thing that ruined my uh, season two gravity posters because they have boundary issues. That's why. I had to film this like this because there is currently dirt all over my desk because I had a potted plant up next to my desk and one of them knocked it over while I was sleeping the other night and I haven't been able to clean off my desk yet. Anyway, so this has been my unboxing, unpackaging, whatever you want to call it, of my signed Cravity album, signed by Ruben. Now I gotta go put it on my shelf. I don't know where I'm gonna put it. But I guess I'll figure that one out. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! <laughs>